See, the crazy thing is, is I've only had one girlfriend in my life. And that girl was like what I made most of my music about. Now mm -hmm. I feel like there's so much more to talk about. You know what I mean? There's life problems, you know? And life is kind of good right now. So I've been making some happier music, you know? But I'm definitely waiting for like Dua Lipa to come around and break my heart so I can make a crazy album. There we go. You heard it here first. Dua, Dua. You heard, she does yeah, yeah. watch Impulsive. You, you said what? You called her Lainey? Lainey? Yeah. Yeah, she's fire. That's a band. I think it's dudes. But she's probably there's probably somebody named. There's, the, there's a girl named Lainey too. somewhere in the world. We gotta give we gotta give him the benefit benefit of the fucking doubt, dude. Dua Lipa, huh? Yeah, she's fine. Celebrity crush? Yeah, definitely. She, I think she got a boyfriend. I don't care. <laughs> hey, she she might she might. Is I that, don't know. I, it, she she watches the show. She'll see us. How do you feel about that kind of stuff? Like like going after a. a a girl that might like <clears throat> date a guy or like have oh, dated a guy. I'm not gonna go after her. I'm just saying, whenever she's done, oh, I'll be waiting. God. Yeah, got you. I'll be there. He's, I see. Like that's polite. He's butter. Yeah, yeah. I'll, I'll let her polite. finish. I'll let her finish whatever she's doing. So you're not going after a lot of chicks that have. Uh, and then you're probably, first of all, I keep saying going after, but let's be honest, you're not going after girls. But I'm saying, uh, if a girl, are girls uh, coming if, after you, dude? For sure. You know. But on front, he doesn't want. He's humble. Don't be the fucking cool no, guy. Stop being the stop being the cool guy. A <laughs> girl's coming after you. <laughs> Yo, man, they're just doing their thing. There you go. Yeah, he's yeah, so yeah, he's that's humble. That's what they call it. Yo, that's humility, what they call it. humility at twenty one. That is the coolest so, answer. Yeah, they're doing their. Her, his PR guy's like, cool thing to say to that. They're doing <laughs> their thing. And he's like, he sat there waiting. He bobbed his head. He goes, got it. Yeah, man, they're he's just doing their thing. <laughs> he's got that's why they're sitting here. They're, they're not even friends. The PR team. <laughs> Can I ask you a question? When you when you said your last projects had to do with your girlfriend, you, one, my question is, are you good with her now? And then two. How mad is she listening to the radio every two seconds to that fucking song? Um, I don't know if she's doing good right now because she she sees it. She sees what's going on. And she's the one that fucked up, really. So talk about regret. Eesh. Yeah, man. I mean, I did something stupid. I went to go see her last time I was in my hometown. And I I'm not we you know, I probably shouldn't even bring this up. You don't have to. We could we could switch topics right now. I mean, we'd love to hear it, but if you don't want to talk about it, you don't have to talk Let's about it. Let's just say I ended up in a car and it was hauling ass and she wasn't slowing down and she was telling me that she would never put me in danger, but we're going 100 miles an hour in a lifted Jeep. Yep, that sounds dangerous. Swerving. She was not cool. Right. But yeah, no, I think she's doing fine. <laughs> <laughs> she's just breaking the speed limit. Was, was it one of those things where she had... Both hands on the wheel, on the steering white wheel, white knuckling, just like I'm never gonna put you in danger. <laughs> exactly <laughs> like that. She's like, please, funny <laughs> seatbelts on. I'm sure you would've been fine. I'm telling her to take me home. She's like, I'm gonna take you to Waterburger. I know you're hungry. I'm like, bitch, I'm not hungry. But I'll if we, <laughs> yeah, but if we go, get me a patty melt. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> slow down, slow down. Number four, number four. Slow down. <laughs> would you? Would you ever? I know some artists uh, that'll do this. They'll they'll intentionally put themselves in uh, an emotionally. Uh, fucked situation, like in inevitably doomed from the beginning, just to be inspired to make music. Have you ever hit that wall where you you need inspiration? Like I'll go, I'll go fall in love real quick and, and try to shatter my heart so I can get some inspo. <laughs> no, I haven't done that yet. You seriously? Could you? I yeah, I think so <laughs> for sure. For, yeah, it's kind of fucked. You masochist in any way? What does that mean? Uh, uh, you you like pain? Uh, it's more so physical, but uh, maybe emotional masochist. Like, do you like when um, you're turned on by pain? Like, like do you want do you somebody like to get to, like, slapped whip, in the face? Like whip you? Like dressed in like leather? And shit like that. <laughs> no. I'm, I'm not talking about. I'm, <laughs> what's your safe word? What's your safe yeah, word? I'll you get there. Word? What's your safe word? My safe word? Yeah. yeah. If you want somebody to stop. Oh you. oh um shit. I don't shit. know. Shit. It's a good one. I talked shit. about this. <laughs> He's like shit. <laughs> No, I don't have a safe word. I feel like I haven't explored a lot of things in that world. You know what I mean? I definitely never gone whipped. Right. In any way. Are you open to it? Have you ever been whipped? I don't know. I feel like that would piss me off. Yeah. Getting whipped. Yeah. I would whip somebody though. Uh, how There's hard? A Pretty hard. Really? <laughs> yeah. I had the opportunity. Um, it's, it's, it's interesting because you say that. And I said that. <laughs> and then I had the opportunity. Like the whip was given to me by the female. And right. I remember and I could, I, yeah. I could, I just couldn't do you it. Couldn't show up. I couldn't do. I mean, I could a little bit. Like it was kind of fucked up, though. I made it a joke, like I do with everything. I was like, "Yeah, you look fucking like that." It's just like, <laughs> just like like this, like this, like this. I was like, "It's giving me like two percent." And I, cause bro, cause dog, dog, bro. If I swing too hard one time, she's like, "Yo, what the fuck?" We and I'm like, 
We talked I about s- this on the show on a show one time. If a girl has a whip and hands it to you, she don't want 10%. She wants 150. But you're never like, bro, those girls, like the choke me girls, like that are blue and they're saying, please keep going. And you're like, yo, this is homicide. And they're like, no, 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 no. It's like, like those girls know what they're fucking doing. And it is scary for you. And it's a very thin line it is. between ever- S&M and and murder. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? They it's, give you like a safe word that's hard to say, like shach and You're like, yeah. I don't even know how to say it. That's dangerous. Yeah. What does that mean? It's what? eggplant in Assyrian. <laughs> Are you fucking kidding me? I swear to God, it's eggplant in Assyrian. She's like, shach That's my safe word because she's like, shach And I was like, not it. Sorry, kid. We're going to have to keep going. <laughs> eggplant.